Sean Ashmore knows how to make temperatures drop as Iceman from the original X-Men. Now he's giving us the chills in the new psychological thriller, The Free Fall. Take a look. I can't find you like that again. I won't let it happen. I need you. Do you understand? Yes. We have each other. We don't need anyone else. I love you. I will never leave you. And Sean is with me now. Hi, so nice to see you. Nice to see you. How are you? I'm doing great. Listen, this movie is such a nail biter right from the start, and it keeps you guessing all the way to the end. What did you think about this when you first read the script? I loved it. Um, it's it's a psychological thriller. It's also a mystery, you know. Yeah. And for me, as an audience member, I, you know, I'm out, when I'm reading a script, I'm picturing the movie that, it, that that's going to be made. Yeah. And I was guessing throughout as well. So, and then when the reveal happened, I was like, oh yes, it was satisfying. It was like it paid off in a way that yeah. I liked. And also, I love the character of Nick. It's not the kind of character I get to play all the time. Yeah. And I love the ambiguity of him. I like the darker side of him. And so I, it was a no-brainer. I wanted to do it immediately. Yeah, I mean, and, and so Nick is the husband. And even from, like, I don't want to give anything away, but even from the trailer, I mean, we just don't know if we can trust Nick, right? Yes. Yeah, there's something off. I mean, so Sarah, the uh, Andrea Londo, uh, who, who plays my wife, she yeah. um, wakes from uh, an attempted suicide. So, you know, she's recovering with no recollection of her former life. So yeah. automatically you're seeing the world through her eyes and everything's unsettling. The question is, 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 is she just recovering from this tragic event and that's why everything seems strange? Or is Nick, her husband, is there something off about him? So that's the sort of like tightrope that we try to walk. And yeah. um, I think I think it's kind of an interesting journey. Well, on a lighter note, we can actually see you on the small screen as well as uh, Wesley and ABC's The Rookie, which is in its fourth season. So how has it been to work on a series that really captures the ups and downs of life on the police force? I love it. And I think um, from my experience, uh, it's just a fun show to be a part of. And we have a great fan base that loves our characters and loves yeah. the twists and turns. And it's just it's a good it's a good show. It's really fun. Nice to be able to do two different projects that are so completely different, too, I Always. imagine. Yeah. That's the goal. Yeah, that's the thing. The Rookie is also like, there, I, Wesley, my character, has been put through some pretty heavy things. Yeah. But at the end of the day, the Rookie, to me, always swings to the positive. There's always yeah. an upside, you yeah. know? Um, and, and I love that about the show, and I think that's what the audience loves. It's like, yeah, it's real life. Bad things happen, but our characters persevere and work yeah. through it and, 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 and t tend to end up on... The upside. When we were doing research for this interview. We saw um, the Peace Neighbor project that you had started. <laughs> yeah. Tell us a little bit about it. So Peace Neighbor is uh, in the um, beginning stages of the lockdown. We're here in Los Angeles and my whole family, we got COVID like the first round. So yeah. we were like stuck in our home. It was really scary. We yeah. really isolated for a long time. And the only interaction I had was, you know, people walking their dogs back and forth. And I would just throw the peace sign up to my yeah. neighbors. And yeah. inevitably, I would get a smile or a wave or a nod or whatever. And I just it just felt good to me to connect with somebody. So I just started to, to doodle and make some designs um, and make hats and shirts. And it's just Peace Neighbor. And it's just a simple yeah. thought. And yeah. it just felt good. And um, that's it. I love that. It is such a simple thing. But it's something that kind of just makes you feel good and makes somebody else feel good. And so yeah. you don't have to exert a lot of energy to just do that. Nope. But you know nope. what I mean? I love that. A simple greeting. A simple a greeting. Simple greeting. greeting. Can, can change yeah. your mood. Um, so that's it. That's the idea behind it. Well, and congrats on the projects you've got going on now. Thanks for taking the time to chat with me today. You can catch the free fall in theaters and on VOD now. Thanks so much. Have a wonderful day. Thank you. Great talking to you. Peace. Peace. <laughs>